Hi, my name is Pankaj Dube and in this video we are going to talk that how does Wi-Fi work. So a little introduction of the Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is a technology used to provide wireless internet connectivity within a given range. The Wi-Fi stands for Wireless Fidelity. It is an Australian invention and Wi-Fi is a trademark of the Wi-Fi Alliance. It was introduced in September 1998 and it works on 2.5 to 5.8 GHz. So how it works like a wireless router receives the internet data through the phone line or mobile networks and then convert that data into radio signals which then received by Wi-Fi signal receiver devices like your computer, smart TV, mobile and any such stuff. So how it works let's see with an example. So there is a router and there is a it is connected to the internet through any wire technology. There is a client that wants to connect to the router in order to get the internet access. Wireless router continuously broadcasts the SSID and Wi-Fi signal. Client sees the Wi-Fi signal and the SSID and props the request. The router sends an open system authentication request and in response the client sends an open system authentication response. The association request is granted by the Wi-Fi receiver and the association response is sent by the client. So this is how the interaction happens between the access point and a client machine who wants to get connected to the router. Now the router and the client both sends their network and uh, data packets on different different signals so they do not mix up with each other. So here in this uh, example you can see that they, they both the, both the machines are sending the, their data packets on different different signals. Now what is SSID? So SSID is the name associated to any wireless network access point. So here you can see that in this access point, in this screenshot, these are the names associated with many access points using which we can get the internet access. So in simple language, these, these are the human readable text that is associated to any router or wireless access points. In simplest language, it is the name of your Wi-Fi router. SSID stands for Service Set Identifier and receivers ignore the data packets from any other SSID. Now what is access point? Access point is a networking hardware device that allows a connection between a client and internet provider. So in simple language, an access point is your router. So what is the range? The Wi-Fi signal range depends upon the frequency band, radio power output, antenna gain and antenna type as well as the modulation technique. And the line of sight is the thumbnail guide but reflection and refraction can have a significant impact on the range of your Wi-Fi signal. Now what is channel? So each Wi-Fi sends signal on different different channels. The best channel for your Wi-Fi is the one not being used by most of the, your Wi-Fi network, networks around you. So it means that your neighbors aren't using the same Wi-Fi channel that your Wi-Fi setting is using. So for example, most other Wi-Fi networks are using in channel 11, then you can switch to channel 1 or 6. What you can do, you can simply download some applications from your App Store or the Play Store and then you can check the channels around you. And you can have a look at what are the different different Wi-Fi routers are using the different different channels. And then after that you can go to your modem settings and change your Wi-Fi channel to get a better internet speed. So in my next video we are going to talk about the Wi-Fi authentication models and the weaknesses associated with them and how a hacker exploits those weaknesses so that you can be a pen tester by knowing the weakness and then by knowing that how you can defend against those attacks. Thanks for watching.